Hey guys, and welcome back to Cold Fear. When we last left off, we had a crazy plan. And we are going to try and jump from the crow's nest onto an oil platform in this rain. Well, it's a crazy plan, but it might just work. I mean, it has to work, right? Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's go. How are you feeling, Tom? You feeling confident? Because I'm not overly confident. Listen, Hanson, I've got some bad news for you. Goody. Three. What is it now? We've known about that oil rig for a while. It's got some sort of radio fuzzer on it. No transmissions in or out except in a very tight window that we can't get into. Oh, good. Which means? Which means that until you take care of that jamming device, I won't be able to help you. I'm heartbroken. I'm serious, Hanson. <laughs> <laughs> the only way you get off that rig is if I help you, and I can't help you unless I can talk to you. So once you get on board, you smash that jammer, you got it? Sorry, you're breaking up. I can't hear you. Hanson! Hanson! Just kidding. <laughs> smash the jammer. <laughs> got it. Hanson out. <laughs> you know what, actually? I quite like this Hanson Jack. <laughs> He's funny. Oh, good. Oh, good. We knew there was going to be some kind of battle here. Help me! Help me. Can you not find yourself a gun, woman? I mean, seriously. There's plenty of them about. Or even if you just took a cleaver off one of these jabs. Alright. Uh, another issue I have found since going back and ed editing these videos is that because of the weird glitching and shit we had in the prior parts, all of the audio is really out of sync. That's bad. <laughs> I mean, it's really out of sync. But with the game running nice and smooth like this, uh, that doesn't appear to be an issue at the moment. Anyway, let's go. Oh, hey, sir. Anna, you couldn't have told me there was one here? You just kept that to yourself, huh? Oh, good. Hello, sir. Dude. Anna, where are you? Ooh. You son of a bitch. No luck. I'm over the AK. Good, 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 good. Let's rock. Anybody up here? Of course there is. Ow. Dude. Not fair. Not fair. You're not meant to slap me around when you're dying. Do you want to save? Wow, look at the saves. Saves out the ass. Sure. You sure you want to do this? It's our only chance. How did I know you were going to save that? Uh. Surely this would do irreparable damage to the rig. I'm just saying. Made it! Oh, shit. Uh, that was part of the plan, right? Oh, God. We're going to get infected, aren't we? Oh, shit. I was not expecting that to happen. Um, bit of a storm going on, guys, and we have lost all of our weapons. Jesus Christ. Okay, well. God damn it! Shit, screwing my vision. Yeah, uh, I think you've got bigger problems to worry about than uh, a little bit of rain. Okay. Alright, let's get, get out. Whoa, 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 whoa. I did not realise that we could fall through that. Noted. Um, I mean, at least that was strong enough to stop the ship in its tracks. That I was uh, surprised about. So, where are we going? I guess up there. Or maybe through here. Oh, good gun drops. Run! Run, run, run. 
I think we timed that pretty well. Uh, shit. Okay, that's fine. Everything is fine. I'm fine. You're fine. Hanson's fine. Alright, can we fiddle with anything? Oh, I like this. Pretty fucking low. Apparently. Right, I guess we can't do anything with that. Let's try the big door. The door seems like the logical thing. I wasn't sure how we could open that, but hey. Block elevator. Let's go further up, shall we? Hello? Anybody here? Oh, good. Oh, good. 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 Wonderful. Great even. Yeah, no shit, Hanson. Uh, right, plan B. Can we go through here? No. What about this way? I guess so. Maybe, yes. Oh, hey, sir. Dude, could you please not burn me to death? If that's quite alright with you. All burned up. Yeah, makes sense, I suppose. Right, onwards, Hanson. Keep frosty. Keep very frosty. Ooh. Motherfucker. I guess we can't break it either. We're gonna burst again. Are we good? We're good. Right. Slowly does it, my dude. Slowly does it. Right. We can't afford to get hit. You got anything for me? A health pack. Nice. Well, that's certainly uh, changed our fortunes a little bit, didn't it? So, what have we got here? Armory. Yes. Armory, please. Can I have some guns? Like, maybe all of the guns? Some ammo. Yeah, we're fully loaded. Um, quite a nice little armory you got here, actually. Fully loaded. I guess all the good shit's been taken. I know, we still only have the handgun. Alright, well, I mean... Can't break that stuff either. It's a bit of an ass. Uh, right, well, I mean, we're in better shape than we were. Ammo, but no guns. That's fine. And we have a sick bay here as well. Let's have a little... Uh, yes? Sure. The You know, the um, save points are really a little bit all over the place. Stay back! I'm... With Anna. Help me. You're alive. Good. There's only a little time to inject the antidote after infection. So now tell me whose life I just saved. You know Anna, yes? No. She's gone. I'm Tom Hansen, USCG. You bring terrible news. Did she tell you about this place at all? No. And yet you came here anyway. Then I must tell you. Kamsky and his father and I were sent here to study the exocells when they climbed up onto the platform. Maybe the drilling woke them up, eh? We were told to learn what they were and how to control them. But Kamsky went past that. He wanted to use them. And this is the result. It will kill us all. Where's this radio jammer I heard about? And it's Shenko. It kept it in the magnetic field room. You can't get in. It has retinal scanner locks. And only an Itchenko can open it. Then I guess I'll just have to ask him to open it for me. He'll kill you first. Not if we kill him first and then take his skull. Am I glad to see you again? Uh, well, I mean, I guess so. We didn't actually get a chance to use it before, but sure. Uh, I have some health there, which is good. Well, I mean, you know, I thought, um... Getting cured of the infection was going to be some long 
arduous task, but, um, you know, sometimes it's nice when things are easy, I guess. Alright, we can go that way, I guess, so we can go that way. Good thing there was someone here to help us. Now, where's, thing's stuck. where's the other dude pissed off to? Nothing to read in here. I thought there might be a log or something. Oh, that was a log. All right. Letter to soup. The first phase of the operation has been partly successful. Dr. Kamsky and his associates have succeeded in producing a powerful, uh, if what, efferacious and dangerous beings uh, that can only be considered monsters. The injection of a partial antidote prior to the forced contamination is giving excellent results. Many of these things die quickly, but we have managed to produce creatures that are impervious to bullets. Good. Wonderful. The fools! Immeasurable, immeasurably stronger than our finest soldiers, and even partly invisible, yay. The possibilities are endless. Sadly, we have not yet perfected a process by which these monsters can be controlled. Now our key priority, Dr. Uh, Balaclava's enzyme gas is most promising in this respect. I'm sure you'll be able to understand that we need a little more time, Dimitri. Right, uh, okay, so... Uh, you created a, a creature that is almost invisible and impervious to bullets, and then you thought about how to control it as a secondary concern. Oh, boy. Alright, so, I mean, if that was tucked away there, is there any other... Is there any more reading material? There is more reading material. A note about the retinal scan. Um, the magnetic field control room is now off limits to all unauthorized personnel. The new security system in place incorporates a retinal scan lock. At this, As of this moment, only Colonel Soup and myself are cleared for entry. Anashenko. And I know that's not how you say his name now, because I heard it, but I can't remember how he said it, so... Sue me! Right, let's go. Anything. One more thing. Yeah. Uh... You need to... Uh... Well... He's gone. Right. Nothing found, even though there's something clearly flashing to the storeroom. Oh, good. So he's now dead. Now, I don't know if anybody noticed that quickly. His head was uh, by his feet in that cutscene for a quick brief second. Right, impervious to bullets, you say. Ain't that a fun time? What have you got for me, sir? Oh, you got the shotgun for me. More spear gun ammo. Yep, yep. The spear gun, cool stuff, man. What about the shotgun? Good old shotgun. Nice. Well, we'll have the shotgun. Uh, so we've got a spear gun. That's cool. I don't know what exactly that does or how it works. I'm guessing it's just going to distract them for a little bit. Giving us valuable time to escape. Which is fine. It's nice now we can actually aim at things. Without our... Um... Oh, and there's the AK. They're just giving us back all the weapons. Cool. Happy with that. Uh, can we grab the AK, please? Please? Add Thank you. Arsenal. Yep. Add it to the arsenal. Right. I'm going to go back. Oh. Hey, friend. 
Right, let's go back. Cause we only have like one load of ammo for every weapon. Let's go back to the armory and top up. Seems like a reasonable idea at this point. I think we're living in the armory, to be honest. Ah, sweet, sweet serenity. Right, not bad. Is that all you can hold? 21 bullets? I mean, okay. To be fair, the AK is pretty bitching. So, you know, there's that. Considering this is an Ubisoft game, I'm surprised we never got a series out of this. But then, I guess we did have that lull of survival horror games where all the big companies were telling us that nobody wants them. But I would have liked to have seen more from this. Because this ain't bad, you know? Ooh. Ooh, what the fuck? Wow, those things hurt. Oh, man, they hurt. Dude. Dude. That was savage. Okay. Stay frosty, Hanson. Where do I get the feeling that the shit's going to hit the fan in here? He's Storeroom. <sighs> oh, yes. My... My senses are tingling here. There's something breathing in here. Definitely something breathing in here. Ammo for the AK, that's cool. Oh boy. Get rid of as many of these drones as, as we can. Nothing for me. A med kit would be nice. No. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Wow, this place is fucked up, man. Uh, you know, all these companies think this is such a good idea of messing with nature and um, these, you know contaminants and god knows what else, these mutants. Hey friend. Wow, that accuracy there. Right, you're not gonna... Yeah, your parasite's gone. Nothing useful, dude, seriously. Yeah, it's definitely nice not to have to worry about that, uh rolling water anymore. Very nice. Ah, a container that didn't contain an enemy. Interesting. Damn! Yeah. No goodies for me today. I guess we can't have a little look in that one, because, you know, fire. Fire burns skin and, you know, that, all, that, all that jazz. Right, this place actually looks fairly empty. Which I'm surprised about. I was expecting all manner of bad mix. Pistol ammo. I mean, we take it. <laughs> wow. Talk about the quick stepper. Alright, what we got? Oh. Man. Yeah, I can still hear enemies breathing. There's definitely something more in here. Unless it was you that I can hear breathing away. I haven't got the right weapon for this ammo. Oh! A handheld grenade launcher. What's this doing here? I have no idea, Hanson, and we don't care what it's doing there. All that matters now is it's in our pocket. Ooh, we hold a good amount of rounds for it too. Fully loaded with this ammo. 
10 shots. It's opening. What's opening? So, grenade launcher. Hmm. Definitely didn't expect to get a grenade launcher. Okay. Oh. No? Come on, buddy. Yes, there we go. Oh, there's one of them gone. There's the other one. Nice. There's still more of them down there. But that's fine. We've got a freaking grenade launcher now. Uh, dude, you've just gone and set yourself on fire. Is there any need for that? Oh, fucking hell. We have hostiles. Pistol ammo. Nice. Any more for any more. Nothing on him. Okay. So what the fuck did we just open up? You know, I. it's got to be said. I do like the pistol. It is a good weapon. I guess that's it. Yeah, cool story, dude. Blow it out your ass. I guess that door is what we've opened. Okay, I need to move my coffee and drink my coffee. Mm. Ah, much better. Oh, yes, please. Yes, please. Uh, sure. What the hell is that? Uh, what the hell is what? That cutscene was over and done before I could even see what the fuck that was about. Oh, shit. Again, didn't have to go down like that, but we just came in and shot everyone in the face. He doesn't have any more ammunition. A page from Dr. Kams Kamsky's diary. Let's have a little read, shall we? No. Scientific classification of the exocells is impossible because we have never seen anything like it before. It's as if some alien creature had crawled up from the depths, or some prehistoric survivor of ages long gone had awoken for reasons yet unknown. DNA testing on the multiple pes uh, specimens indicates certain similarities to various anthropods, but the leak is uh, tenuous at best. Traces of other DNA, including mammalian, have also been found, but the results have been maddeningly inconsistent. Back lava has advanced the known... Uh, no sh as advanced the notion that they are merely some sort of deep sea creature affected by the former government's practice of dumping its nuclear waste ah that old chestnut nuclear waste at a nearby deep water site uh soup takes such thoughts very seriously and i have often found him examining maps of the area with the maps of the area uh, with which he claims to be familiar. Having spent a part of his career there, perhaps he knows of things that I do not. What we do know is this. Exocells are perfectly adapted to underwater life, capable of uh, resisting enormous and varying degrees of pressure. Not like us wretched humans. Yes, well. We think we are above the law. We are above the laws of nature. Oh. 
Much better. Nice. Okay. All these paperwork's everywhere. Can't fit to use any of it. Okay. You know, there's something very satisfying about the way heads pop in this game too. But then the developer of this game, um, Criticton Games, I believe. Oh, are pretty damn good. Okay. Press the action button repeatedly to break free. Uh, the action button? What's the action button? Um, shit. Where the fuck is that thing gone? Wow, that thing hurts. Is it dead? It is not dead. It is not dead. Can we kill it? If it bleeds, we can kill it. Come on, buddy. Grenade launcher is not very effective. It's fucked off. Oh man, I could use a do-over on that. Kind of wishing I didn't waste all of my grenade ammo. Is this a thing that bullets don't hurt? I'm getting the feeling that that's the thing that bullets don't do a lot with. Uh, missing in action. I mean, I'm pretty sure that, you know, when most of your body's actually missing. That? I think we're going to try and avoid that thing. I don't think we can put it down. All right, let's go back through there. We need a pistol here. So we can't see what we're doing with the other one. There we go. Right, I think there's one more up there. No, they're all dead. Oh, we had a health pack on him. Nice. That means there's another health pack there that we haven't used yet. Right, so we've read that. Okay. Yeah, so I think the best thing to do with that motherfucker is to just run away from it. I think that's like all we can do with it. To be honest. Right, you. Hey, Fido. Fetch. Can we like blow it up? No, I mean, I guess not. Right. Uh, come on, weapon. Where the fuck is it? Oh, there you are. Hey, sir. There, have some of that. That hurts it. How much that hurts it, I have no idea. But we're out for it anyway. We've got one shot left with the dark gun. Shit! Hey, sir! Right, have that. Right, so you can kill those things. Uh, you They can be killed. I guess that's good to know. They're just exceedingly hard. Well, actually, if you've got the dart gun, they're not that bad. Right, we are kind of in the shit, though, in regards to health. Is that because we're bleeding? Is that why we're leaving those bloody footprints? Alright. 
We need a weapon with considerably more firepower. But I am a fan of the fact that we can kill those things. The habitation module, that door looks closed. Right, onwards! Onwards! Forever. Onwards. Why do I get the feeling there's going to be more of those things? There's going to be more of those things, isn't there? And when I say there's going to be more of those things, I mean there's going to be more of those things in here. Was that? Pistol ammo. Oh. Okay. Cool. Looks like shotgun shells. Alright. That's not bad. Have some equipment. There's another door there. Fully loaded with shotgun shells. Cool. I mean, pistol ammo is good. I don't think it's going to help us much against that thing. Fucking predator. Marching around here. Thinking it's got iron bollocks. Bastards. Okay. Definitely full of shotgun shells. Uh, any other goodies in here? I mean, pistol ammo is cool. I would be interesting. Interesting. I would be interested to see how many shots it takes to put one of those things down with a pistol. Probably a lot. Bearing in mind, we did bounce his ass around with a grenade launcher. And that didn't really even do too much. Oh. Uh, why was that thing running from him? A letter to Ashenko. Ah. Uh, I think again. Yeah, why was... More spear gun ammo. Actually, nice. Well, this place has gone to the dogs. Ah, oh, health kit. How many spears have we got? One. Eh, yeah, one's better than none, I suppose. You right there, chief? No luck. Be quite happy to have some spear ammo from you guys. If that's not too much to ask. Fucking hell, who thought this would be a smart idea? So we've got a letter to read. There's nothing else in here. Damn. I guess not. Like server room or something. Can't do anything with that. That blatantly looks like a file that we can read, but I guess not. Right, let's have some light reading then, shall we? Yeah, we read that one. Yuri, congratulations on your assignment to the star of... Uh Sharkalin, or whatever the fuck. You know, you know how much faith I have in you since our shared posting in Afghanistan. In recent years, you have been a valuable part of our organization, always making the right decisions faced with our many problems. The cartel recently informed me of its complete satisfaction. I must stress that this new assignment is potentially more dangerous than previous undertakings. Obviously, your comprehension and oh, compensation and funding will be uh, commes will be commiserate. Will be is it to commiserate? Uh, to the risks run. The orders are straightforward: guard the platform against any and all intruders. The star of uh, Sarkelin is radar jammed which should make matters easier. Do not hesitate to encourage 
the scientists to work faster. The sooner they get it done, the sooner you will receive your payment. I know you do not like having women, and Anna is a woman, uh, interfere with your work. But I have no choice in the matter. When all this is finished, Boris's finest vodka is on me. Dimitri. Uh, actually, if we go through the manual, I think Dimitri is the Kamsky guy. As it actually say. Uh, yeah, so Anna is a woman. So I guess he knows. Um, I mean, we don't know how he knows that. Whether it's just visual identification or he's a fucking genius. I don't know. Doesn't like having women interfere with his work. What a douchebag. Right, anyway, guys, uh, we're on 35 minutes, so I'm going to have to end this here. When we return, we're going to continue going through here and fighting that weird predator thing, I guess. I mean, there's probably going to be more of them, right? So, till then, guys. Thanks for watching.